Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how I do my own version of passion twist. I've been seeing a, a tutorial, many tutorials on this passion twist on YouTube. I said, let me try my own version. All right. If you want to see how I achieve my own, just stay tuned and enjoy the video. Thank you. I have my braiding hair here. This is um, three times. This is the stretch hair. That is what I'm going to use for today. And I have my skewer stays. Okay. I bought it at my local supply store here. All right. So I'm going to use both of them to achieve this fashion twist. Okay. I go ahead to brush the hair out because I'm not going to stretch. It's already stretched. It's pre-stretched braiding hair. All right. I brush it out. I take little strand. Depending on how big I want my coils to be, all right. This is how I'm taking. To let you guys know, you need your rubber band too, all right. For this fashion twist, you read your rubber band, or if you have bobby pins, you can use. So I have my skewer stays. Okay, you can use straw to achieve this or you can use pencil all right the first thing i'll do is to this is the braiding hair i've already brushed it out it's smooth i wrap it around this this stick all right after that you twist it this way this way this way when you finish twisting it you use your rubber band to secure it here so that it won't lose it won't unravel secure it this way after that you continue to twist it around this stick like this make sure you are not leaving enough space all right so that the coils will bounce continue to twist it You see the way I'm twisting it. I think I'm leaving a nose paper, but don't worry. I will need to adjust it. All right. After twisting it, right, you turn it to this way. You cover the gap. Covering the gap around here. Okay. And you secure. You secure it with your rubber band. You secure it with your rubber band. You know the space I left here is much. So I want. I don't want more space on my own. I pull it this way okay this is what you get at the end all right I will do another one okay this is uh, another one I want to show you guys just watch I think uh, it's better for you to watch okay Make sure you secure the first 
here so that it won't unravel. Use your rubber band or your baby pin. Rubber band preferably. So hold here. Alright, then you start to twist it around the stick. Make sure you are not leaving enough space. When you get to the to this point, you use it to cover the spaces you left. And you use a rubber band to secure it so that when you are after dipping it in hot water when you're losing it, it will come out well. All right. All right, the next thing is to dip the twist in hot water and pour hot water on them. All right. Pour it gently. I'll make sure that water touches all of them, the hot water, because um, the stewart stick is a little bit longer. a dry knit the next day I will go ahead to lose the coils I will show you how to do that now all right you go ahead to remove the rubber band okay you lose it this way this way Gently lose it. Gently lose it this this way. You remove the rubber band in here, or you can cut it out. You pull out the hair from here. Can you see our passion twist? Okay, remember we folded this into two. This here is it. We folded it into two. You go ahead to open, open it from here gently so that you won't spoil it. From here, all right. So I will open, open it this way. You do it gently. Do it gently.
Okay. So do you see my passion? So do you see our passion twist? Okay, our passion twist is ready. We can go ahead to trim off the some of the end. I will show you how to install it. Bye, see you in my next video.